that I've been really impressed with is just these like independent brands. And uh, J. Marie uh, is the uh, premium sneakers. And uh, I'm going to read just a little bit of background so I can make sure I get this right. Um, in terms of the brand, well, maybe let's just talk about it. So I, I think I got to her sneaker brand by just like Googling independent sneakers. And I was just like really blown away with the clean kind of lines, but also big colors and brightness. And so I did reach out to her just to get a little more background. And she was really kind to sort of send over some, some more information. So they are conceived in Detroit, but they're handcrafted in Italy. And, uh, you know, she basically said in high school, she, you, you know, you couldn't catch her uh, in gym shoes. She loved heels. Uh, she loved the feminine way they made her look. And then graduating from college, not so much. Uh, she said in the corporate world and moved to downtown Detroit, her life became parking structures and a lot of walking. And as someone who lived in New York and Atlanta and actually took the train in Atlanta, which not many people do, I can appreciate a lot of walking. Uh, then came health issues, et cetera, et cetera. And she ended up fi founding J. Marie Premium Sneakers, which was launched in 2018. And she partnered with an Italian uh, footwear maker uh, family with over 20 years of experience with pure craftsmanships. And what I've done is I've linked to a few of the pictures and you're gonna see sort of some designs that look like things you kinda know, but they're put together in a, like a very unique way and just some really great color blockings and animal prints and you know, there's they're, a different vibe. And uh, hats off uh, to her and her, her uh, shoe brand. We're gonna try to get her on the show to talk about the brand a little more. And, uh, you know, let me know if you end up picking up a pair, what you think. All right, uh, like I said, it was a little weird in terms of travel schedule, so we...